We are a 100-year-old business. We're a third-generation family business. Our grandparents came here as immigrants, worked hard. And their mantra was two things, be the best you can be and treat people as you'd like to be treated. The Benjamin's named after Benjamin Denahan Sr. For those people who knew him well, Bud. My father was in the dry cleaning and laundry business. He always went above and beyond. And when I think about how that applies to hospitality, it is so much about going that extra step of really surprising and delighting our customers. There was not a stain he didn't want to get out of a piece of cloth. He had a relentless pursuit of guest satisfaction. The culture in this company is very special. For us, it's authentic, down-to-earth people who work in an organization where they really feel passionate about serving others. It's a family-run business, and those family values are felt in every layer of the organization. There's something about that family atmosphere that pushes you to the extra level, makes you want to think about just not punching in and punching out every day. We allow people individually to be genuinely who they are. They don't need to fit in a certain box. Our fundamental belief that if you free up these real really nice people and tell them to go out there and make the guests feel at home and make other associates feel at home, that they're going to do it in a variety of ways, ways that I'm sitting around a desk won't even come up with. When I read guest comment cards, it's always about the one or two desk clerks or the room attendant or the bellman or the concierge who took that extra level of service that they didn't expect. And I always wonder, how does that happen? I mean, it's not happening at our competitors. We really worry every day about how do we teach our people, how do we learn from our people to really make sure we accomplish our objectives. That includes finding the right people to join the organization, making sure once we've found the right people that we do everything we need to keep them and to make sure that they are rewarded for their efforts. Our repeat guest percentage is up in the 30s because people appreciate what we're trying to do and how we're trying to make them feel when they're here and it's genuine, it's warm and it's honest. Denahan's approach to brand really starts with the customer in mind first. Who's our customer going to be and how do we create a product that really attracts them and gets them involved in the conversation of what it should be. Big brands have trouble doing that because they have so many, they have to do it again and again and again and again. We want to do each one as if we'd never opened a hotel before, if it's our first time. We have one focus, one mission at Affinia Hotels, and that's to make our guests smile. The ability to kind of create your own experience is what Affinia is all about. The James brand really identifies a lot with art and culture. Our guests often look at our team members at James as people that they might want to hang with. What's really great is that the James has a certain way of applying that friendly service to the characters that are part of the James brand. And at the Affinia brand, you've seen that same kind of DNA of friendly, caring service in a different way brought out to the people that are really attracted to the Affinia brand. The Benjamin is your country club in New York City. You're a member here. Our staff really gets to know the guests so we can customize their stay when they're here in New York and make them feel like they're the superstars that they are. Clearly with the brand, it's a stamp of this is what this hotel can bring to you and this is the kind of experience you can expect whether you're in New York, Chicago, D.C. or someplace else. So we feel that although none of our hotels are exactly alike, our stamp of approval is what you can expect to find in different places and that is where we find the kind of loyalty that our customers come to appreciate. Denahan has a very aggressive but realistic growth platform for the future. Our plan is to grow to 25 hotels in the next five years. We think now is a perfect time to be thinking about growth. We have basically all components, the capital, the know-how, and the relationships to really benefit from this place in the market. I'm very excited about our future. Our plans are to grow throughout the United States and other key urban areas where we think our brands will do well. Denahan is in the perfect position right now because we're small enough to be able to take every hotel and give it its own voice. All along we've been working together with our team in the area of branding and marketing in the areas of financial service, of reservation systems. So our infrastructure has been built very well. We've never been better prepared. We have some of the best people in the business here, and we have good experiences outside of Manhattan. So we have a lot of credibility with investors and partners. As people learn more about what Denahan's about and how we operate and how we can drive revenue and how we believe in our people and believe in our service culture, I think the doors are going to be knocking down for more opportunities.